Welcome back to Match Week from the training facilities in Marietta. And I am joined by Atlanta United Technical Director Carlos Bocanegra. We're going to talk a little bit about the facility and much more. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah, thanks for having me. Of course. So tell us a little bit about this facility. It is absolutely beautiful as we're sitting here. Um, tell us a little bit about some of your favorite parts of it and, and how excited it is to finally be open. Well, first off, it's bright out here, which is great. But it's, uh, no, it's, it's very clean and, and contemporary um, with the sunshine out here. We wanted to have... You know, a view, always a view of the fields, and really have that indoor-outdoor door feel, um, not only for the players but for the front office staff. So, um, we've got six fields, three grass, three turf. Uh, we have the show pitch down here, and you know, we have you know, the feature piece is the locker room for the the players, which is the heart of the the team uh, and the organization. And then around it, you'll see um, six other academy locker rooms, uh, front office staff, academy staff. So, we wanted everybody here housed together and just make it feel as one club from top to bottom. Now it's exciting finally opening the training grounds. What's next? What's the next big step for you guys? We started the season, now we have these beautiful training facilities open. So what are you guys looking forward to next? I think one of the biggest things is having a home and, and having a home base where the guys can get comfortable and live here every day, really. Um, you know, we have this fantastic restaurant here that the guys will have food every day, breakfast and lunch, uh, before and after training. Um, but, you know, there's a lot of spaces where they can hang out and feel comfortable. We wanted to create somewhere where it, it, it was the guys wanted to be here, you know. So whether we're doing English lessons afterwards or the academy is doing some sort of social lesson uh, in and around the, the, the facility, we wanted to have rooms for that, lounge space where they feel comfortable. They can eat, hang out, watch TV, watch games, do video. Um, so it's really about being here. And, you know, we've been on the road. You know, we're at Bobby Dodd, then we're going to Mercedes-Benz. Um, so now we have the training ground, and we hope we can really create uh, a sense of community, a sense of home, and, and have this be our, our base and, and get the guys into it and just get in a routine. Is that sort of how it's going to be when you guys do move to Mercedes-Benz? Because it's, you know, we are at Bobby Dodd now, and, it, and it's nice, but that'll sort of be the next home that these players get to move into. Yeah, it will be. I mean, it's going to be fantastic. It'll be the best stadium in the world until another one is built. Um, it's coming along great, so we're excited for that, but it's been good. I mean, um, we've had to adapt and adjust, and that's what, what you get as an expansion franchise, right? Um, but having this only a couple months into the season uh, be finished so the guys can get here and, and get settled is, is going to be great for us. You mentioned the Youth Academy. Um, they've had a couple of big games over the weekend, a couple of big games this week. Um, are you guys impressed with how, how they're doing so far? Tell us a little bit about them. Yeah, it's been great. So the Academy is something that um, we started even before the first team came along. Uh, we knew it was going to be important. We've got a great area here in Atlanta uh, to pull from. It's a, it's a soccer hotbed in the southeast. So we've, we've been thrilled with that. You know, our 12s up to the 18s. Uh, it's been a fantastic uh, uh, part of the club, and Tony Ennin's doing a great job uh, leading that program uh, as our academy director. You know, the guys are at the GA Cup this week, which is excellent, uh, getting to play against some international competition and test themselves, and, and that's what it's all about. It's not only playing MLS teams and, and local DA teams, it's more how do you test yourself against the best? You know, Real Madrid's a part of the tournament, River Plate's a part of the tournament, so our kids are getting to experience what it takes to get to that next level and play against some of the best competition around the world, which is excellent. 